what coins may change your life in 2018 right now Hey, how are we doing, everyone? Once again, this is Davri from Media Box ENT, where we like technology in crypto. If this is the first time on the channel, you see the little M right there. You're going to press it right now, and then you become part of Media Box ENT. First, I want to say happy 2018. Yes, 71 is gone. Now we start a brand new year, 2018. And the question is what coin we need to have in the portfolio. What coin it will make, may change our life. Maybe we are the next step now. The old step, those one that put, they put in both Bitcoin or the body Ethereum real cheap, or the world is going to real cheap now. How about you? How about me? How about now? Maybe change. And look at the list. There's not many coins left on the penny ones. A penny may will, will change your life. It's a penny of your budget. For me, I think the penny ones, it can change your life. A little bit can be a big thing in the future and i get it much and we way more in 2018 when everything is going to explode i think it will be all gone it will be harder now you see the people now it's harder to get the bitcoin now if bitcoin change your life maybe if you just started now well i twelve thousand dollars a piece how many you need to buy to eventually maybe hit the hundred two hundred two hundred thousand in a few years from now it becomes harder harder for a regular working people to get one bitcoin so how about maybe um ethereum ethereum now since 700 if you boy if you're lucky enough if you want in 2015 you'll be set by now maybe um litecoin is the next coin some people say thirty thousand dollars maybe we had a way in amazon whatever when amazon comes out and says this is a coin we're going to take as a form of payment it's going to explode so this is my list i have the list right there over here so we're going over some of the things i'm thinking they will make it change your life or make a difference. My first one is repo. And this one is a weird one because we know it's a centralized system. We know we can they can pump it up, bring it up and down, and eventually if they have too many, they can control the whole entire market. It's not what we're looking for, right? We will look in the coins of the centralized system, not a centralized. If you have in your portfolio, you were smart enough to get it when it was a few months ago, real cheap, 15, 20 cents, you're already making a difference right now. You already can cash out right now and make a big number. Now, people are talking about $10. First, how many coins it needs to be, or how many, the market needs to be in a trillion dollars. It needs to bypass Bitcoin, bypass everything. It has a trillion dollars because there's too many coins. There's too many. They can make as many as they want. And we know banks control the economy. Banks can create inflation. They can do that. We know the economy around the world is all being controlled by banks. So technically, they can do the same thing with this. Now, you want a quick cash? You want something that will make it different? I think maybe you should have that. I have that, I have that more for you. I bought it real cheap. So maybe I'm still waiting. Can hit people say $10? I don't know. Maybe it's possible. But I'm not definitely a hundred dollars. Now the price of Bitcoin will be will require the whole entire money of the whole entire world to get that coin in that price. It will be impossible. I don't know. I'm thinking hey, maybe I get run. Maybe next year they stole it run. Maybe this thing hits a hundred dollars. Well, I hope so. So you know, nobody knows. But definitely it's a coin to have in the portfolio. And right now we talk about dollar ninety four again. When I'm making the video, when the video goes. Uh, life on YouTube, things can change, it, but this is the beginning of the year, $1.94. It's a good number, unbelievable. Nobody told we'll get out there at $2. We know the Coinbase is going to take it. There's a lot of proof, a lot of messages going on in, in Reddit. And when it goes there, who knows what's going to happen. So maybe get that, get some now, and let's wait. Uh, my next one, Ayora. If you did have Ayora when it was real cheap, a few cents or whatever, 10 cents, not too long ago, a few months ago, summertime, uh, you're making a difference. You're making a killer already. And if you did it wait, when I had this thing hit the $5, what, a few weeks ago, you're already making a killer. You should buy those. Yes, you have. And the portfolio now becomes harder because it's a bigger number. We're not talking penny. Now we're talking dollars amount. And it's still cheap. And it's still 
uh, blockchain 2.0, if you want to call it, Internet for Things. We know they want to use it for all these crazy things. They want to use it to talk about different with the cars. There's a bunch of companies that want to use it. And there was the idea that Microsoft wants to use it, but then it was not really true. Nobody knows. But eventually, they can control a lot of the robots, uh, artificial intelligence. They can be all these things. So if this thing it will ever go and they start using the mass production and using it as some type of the robot system or talking to a fridge or whatever they want to use it for, this thing is going to go up. So I will definitely hold some of those coins in the future. I will have those in my portfolio. I have those. Yes, I do have those in my portfolio. Definitely the ones you need to have. And again, and you need to have some repo. Now, do you buy now? I don't know. I don't know if I will buy repo. I do not buy repo now at that price anymore. I have my account. I have whatever I need. And that's it. I already... Cosa Mayora, like it's expensive now, we leave it there. Next one, Neil. I wish I bought Neil when it used to be, um, and what used to call Ant, Ant, Ant share. It used to be only, not in pennies, Ant share. 20 cents, 30 cents, look now, $75. The same, maybe, will actually bypass uh, Ethereum because it's faster, better, easy to program, at least for the Chinese or the. Uh, it's fussy to program these things, so it's a smart contracts. And Neo together, we get the gas. Now the idea of this is the gas, maybe in the future, they already know the gas will be uh, of gas. And I think if you have 10, it requires you to have 10 Neos to get one gas. A lot of exchanges, they will give you gas uh, once a month. Once a month, they, they will give you a total gas, whatever you have to uh, coins so it's extra money so you hold it and it's and you get the gas too maybe it's better buy gas than uh, what is the gas now 30 bucks so it's better buy gas than neo i don't know 75 dollars is a little high for me at this point i have to let it go maybe it's stupid because uh if that thing is a thousand oh damn why didn't bought a 75 but it will make a big difference in your life well you need to buy who knows a, a humongous amount of quality but say okay it this it changed my life. I can go and do this and this. So it's a little high. Stellar. So there's another one I think everyone should have in the portfolio. It's right now uh, 30, 33 cents. It used to be less like a penny. If you bought that, then you're already making a killer. Um, even if you bought a few weeks ago, you're still making a killer. It used to be five cents, six and ten, and it goes between fifteen cents to thirty-two cents. We have to think the stellar is no different than repo. Actually, this year from, uh, from Repo Quick and Open Hills own company called Stellar, and we know the coins or the tokens and the lumens. Now, I have that in my portfolio. I think you should have that new portfolio. Can that get $10? Once again, we need to move trillions of dollars. They, they issue the same amount as the Repo. Now, we know already partnered with IBM and some other companies, and that, that's why from a penny went all the way to 15, 20, 30 cents. Now, I think also it's going to follow um, as well. It's going to follow uh, Repo because it's a, it's a competition, a straight from Repo. So I think if Repo goes higher, this will follow. And we can see when Repo goes higher, it still goes higher. It kind of they goes each other, and it's pretty cheap right now. Buy some and hold it, and maybe we'll make a difference in the future. Because have in mind that it's the same mechanism uh, as uh, Repo. My next one, uh, Cardano, ADA, 0. 0.71 cents right now. It used to be only, what, 20 cents, 30 cents, maybe cheaper than that. Um, that's another one. Real good. We know that it's uh, in better than Bitcoin. It has a smart contract. It's um, a proof of stake. Faster, and they use all the new technology. They use is much better. So maybe they send maybe the next Bitcoin. Yes, maybe it is. Do you have one of those? I have one of those. The only thing, if you look this side, they said they want it. They want to get the Cardano credit card, and that's kind of weird because we're trying to move from the centralized system and moving back to a centralized. Because if you're gonna tie Cardano to a credit card, you need to get this involved, or you need to get Mastercard involved. Now, you need those guys too. So if they centralize it in a way, but you need to use a centralized system like a Visa or Mastercard to be able to use Cardano. It makes no sense. It's supposed to go and use your phone 
and just pay with Cardano. I understand what the deal is because not everybody's thinking Cardano was well, better have a whatever how many Cardano you have and now you can just swap your credit card and and spend it as any way you want it. But again, you move you moving from decentralized system to centralized system. Should I want a portfolio? I think it is as cheap, seventy one cents. Maybe head to the moon, I don't know. But it's good to have that one. Another one that went not to the moon. What's up? SUB or Statrum. Dollar dollar thirteen right now. Since the the new law, the FCC says we're not gonna be um uh watching, you know, babysitting the cable companies anymore. Guys do whatever you want. So now do whatever you want. What's going to happen now? Well, companies come and say, oh, you know, I don't like this guy. He goes all the time to Conveys because I hate Convey. I hate the crypto thing. And let's block Conveys. Let's block this one. Let's go the price. Or you go too much to this side and they say, okay, you got to pay more. And they can control it. They're going to do that. Who knows? I don't know. But we know when companies fight each other, they can do whatever they want. So you are in the middle. And what are you going to be using? VPN. So the idea of this guy is, and actually this, uh, this thing was created not for the United States. This thing was created for uh, countries like uh, so social countries, they say like Venezuela or, um, or Cuba or to go more communists or like uh, China, Russia. They block, they block the internet. So now you can use the uh, sub just to go and freely be on any site without even using VPN. Like a VPN now is out of, that's a school of VPN with this. And never thought about it, there will be a day that we need it in the United States, not because they block you out because of a politics idea, but they block you out because whatever reason now. So that's why I went from few cents and now it's up a dollar. And it's not up yet, but I guess when this thing going on, and even you can make money on it by just put your computer on the network and let uh, let do whatever you have to do. So when you sleep and you make it, you're making money too now. And let people be browsing by using your system, or you become part of the the network. So definitely, I think it's a token you need to have in your portfolio. Ethos or um, QBX before you're looking for Ethos now dollar twenty. Another one possible it will. It's still not. It's still not fully complete. But the idea they're supposed to complete this year. The whole idea is to have all the universal wallet where you can combine every token there, and kind of the atomic swap where you can just go and 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 swap any coin you want, sell it, and a gateway to fiat. That's a nice tool. So in reality, you no longer need a coin base. You no longer need the exchanges. You can just go and swap any coin you want. And then from there, you can just send it to your bank account if you want to just uh, um, go straight from a, a fiat currency. Get a C. If this thing goes up and people start using it, then for a dollar twenty, it, it used to be only a few cents. Now it's a dollar twenty, so it can be a big difference too. And this is all about the wallet. So this is the wallet that maybe becomes like a universal wallet. So we have to see. Maybe it's a good uh, token to have in your portfolio. So let me go over and go into the list. Uh, Tron. Oh, Tron, another one. So now we're talking the only ones that are a few cents. We talk about four cents. If you got this about a month ago, man, you're making a killer right now. It grabs between four cents to three to five cents. It used to be nothing. It used to be less than a penny. And again, you can buy... I don't know, 10,000, 20,000 this coin, and maybe you just go to the moon. It's supposed to come with the big news uh, now in January. Uh, we know they use, uh, they, it's going to be using, say China has their own way of, their own Facebook, their own YouTube, their own everything. So they're going to be using, um, they got their own Snapchat, so, and they have over 30 million subscribers, so they're going to use Tron or Tron X. Uh, as a part of the payment or as a part to exchange. And the idea that Tron is going to be used also for, it can be used for casino, for entertainment, for games, for movies. They can be used for all those things. And they mentioned a lot of, a lot of Asians are going to be using this. And we know there are plenty, so just imagine that. Now, inflation-wise, we're going to have a lot of tokens up there. So people say it will take a while to hit $2. But once again, 
If you bought 20,000, 30,000 this coin, and that thing has a $2, do some number. It will make it different. It maybe will make a big difference. Maybe it's higher. I know we have to, supposed to come up with a big news so people like Trump. So I said, definitely, it's too cheap. I will have done your portfolio and that too. Definitely, one, it's the one to get. My next one, and maybe that's the one we had to ask everyone to the moon, is Birch Coin. We have it right now, uh, 20 cents. We know that it's 100% anonymous coin. We know that it's 100% better than Monero. We know that it's going to include that atomic swap where you can swap between any, any tokens using the 3.0 wallet. We know the high sort of is the only coin that will hide your IP. It's better, faster, and it's cheap. So if you got this, if you imagine if you got 10,000 of this in every head, like a Monero, do some numbers. Okay, so maybe this is the one. It will hit you, me, everybody else in this channel up to the moon. There are all ones that all these coins will hit to the moon. The problem is it gets harder now. It gets harder and harder. So you need to get this one that has a good future and it's a good team behind it. It's a whole thing show that it can naturally something happen. And we know that some things are worth a penny today. Look, Neo used to worth a penny. Right now it's worth $75. They got good support, and all these coins, it seems to have a good support, a good team behind. They're all working hard, and that's the whole idea. You need to love the technology. If you like the technology, you are in for it. So I think with that, we complete. I'm sure there will be a lot of more coins. You'll say, Dari, why you didn't talk about this coin? How about this one? Well, you know what? It's right below the video. Let me know what will be the coin that thinks is going to change your future, or maybe the coin that will change everybody's future. Let me know. Say, Dari, I need you to... Look this coin, uh, look the network, look the technology, see what this coin is going to do to us. And maybe we do another video on that coin too. You know, we need to go everybody to the moon. This is a spaceship and we need to go up high. All right, guys. Happy 2018. Bye.